Hi, I'm Robin Leach with those champagne wishes, and you're listening to Kitchen Chat with Margaret McSweeney. Good eating. Come on in to Margaret McSweeney's Kitchen for Kitchen Chat, where every week you'll meet chefs, cookbook authors, foodies, gourmets, and just plain people who love to eat. And along with laughter, chat, recipes, and stories about food, you'll sometimes also hear words of inspiration, love, and hope. As Margaret always says, Kitchen Chat is food for the senses and food for the soul. Welcome to Kitchen Chat. I'm Margaret McSweeney, and I know we all want to bring the best into our homes and events that we have. So we have the best here today, Linda Straley, who is a designer and an artist and will help bring beauty into our homes and out of our homes as well. Welcome to Kitchen Chat. Thank you, Margaret. It's awesome to be here. Well, viewers, you were just going to be amazed to also know that Linda is a sculptor and a welder of beautiful designs <laughs> and things that you can use in your home. Can you share with the viewers some of the items that you have? Um, well, I started out making a chandelier for a client. We couldn't find the right one for the space that we had. And I came up with a bright idea of hiring someone, but he said, no, you need to learn how to do this. So I started welding and, um, I do chandeliers, I do um, tour chairs, um, walls of steel bamboo. It's all steel, it's all hand painted uh, with gilders paste and I also use crystals and semi-precious stones on some of them. Um, I've done tables, did a whole kelp series which is really fun, wall sconces, chandeliers, tables. And all of these are in your gallery on your website, is yes. that right? And yes. it's lindastraleydesign.com. Yes. And we'll make sure we provide a link so you can see the beautiful items mm -hmm. that you've designed. But going beyond the artwork, bringing mm -hmm. artistry into the home, I understand you're uh, remodeling a kitchen. And can yes. you share with the viewers how you're mm -hmm. approaching that? Um, it's so important for me to to really tune in to where my clients are coming from. And uh, this particular client in Austin, Texas, is um, kind of a Renaissance type person and loves uh, gourmet cooking. And so we're focusing and planning the kitchen around a Blue Star cooktop and hood. <laughs> and that's going to be a fun project. Wow. It's Mesquite. That'll oh. be interesting. Mesquite wood. and. That will be great. And for all the foodies, of course, out there, we yes. love gourmet kitchens. And is there something we can do at home, just kind of taking your concepts to those at home? What can you do to just simple steps to make your own kitchen shine? Um, I think it's important that you express yourself in your environment. And um, part of cooking is enjoying the process and then of course serving a beautiful plate but uh, I like designing kitchens so that the the hostess and host can participate when they're entertaining their guests today uh, our lifestyles are such that we're really busy and so if we're having a dinner party we're chances are cooking while our guests are arriving and it's great to set up the kitchen so that the the guests can participate in the process that is wonderful. And you travel, too. Yes. You travel to the clients. <laughs> yes, I do. And, and I you, love it. That is great. And so you can help all of us in yes. terms of decorating not only our kitchens and modeling that, but you yes. also do events. Can you share with us some of those? Um, it started out years ago. Um, I had a client who uh, wanted me to help her with a huge birthday party. And then... Uh, another client found out that I had done that birthday party and they said, oh, we want to do a fundraiser. And so I did a Water Wells for Africa fundraiser, which was huge. And that was great fun. Went to Africa and actually bought pieces of carved wood and things to sell and very exciting. And then um, another client lost a parent and they asked if, because I had done some floral arrangements for them, if I would do their mother's memorial service. Mm -hmm. And so I ended up, without realizing it, doing events, which I really enjoy. And um, when I know my clients, it really helps to make the events very special. And this is a special floral piece that you have as well. 
Yes, I just put it together, very organic looking to um, just show some different textures and elements. I think it's important, but uh, it's also important to do things that you love. If you have a favorite color um, and whatever you're, if you want to do very contemporary today, I'm dressed very organic because I just got back from Texas. So, <laughs> but um, I do like crystals and glass and stainless steel as well. So, um, whatever, whatever your your personality is, uh, I would do floral arrangements and things to to accentuate that. So, Linda Straley Design is there for you on any occasion and anywhere, in, anywhere <laughs> inside your home, outside of your home for any event and you will go to the client. Yes. So thank you so much, Linda Straley, for being thank on you. Kitchen Chat TV. We'll have a link to her website. Meanwhile, always remember to take a moment and savor the day.